do. The thing that struck me about them is that there was constant professionalism in the way that they did things. Their business was run as a business. And as we started talking, I began, I began to see that they had a vision beyond the, just you know running one shop or two shops. What I would tell the next uh, businessman or businesswoman, the next entrepreneur is, if you see it, if you envision it, if you believe in it, it's done. It's already done. Now you have to put into practice, you know, and 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 you know, write the vision down. You have to get in the place. I don't care if it's with a crayon, a piece of pencil. Uh, you writing on toilet tissue, whatever you writing on, you got to start bringing that ideal, that dream, that vision to life. You got to write it down. Start, start, uh, start, uh, stop just having it in your head and start bringing it into fruition. You know, you can't, you can't keep making love to something and not, you know, plant a, plant a seed. You know what I'm saying? You guys, you got to plant the seed and then the seed got to start to come, come to life. So I would tell the next, the businessman, the next uh, businesswoman is to take your vision, write it down, start sharing it with people that you can trust, and then you know start creating uh, energy, start creating some type of momentum. Because when you start uh, sharing it with other people, it's going to hold you accountable. S you know, once you start sharing it with people, now they're going to ask you, you know, hey, are you still working on that project that you told me about? And so it's holding you accountable. So you're going to have to. You're going to have to do something or you're going to have to shut up. In, in creating this DVD, we want to get some real, true clarity on, on being a barber and someone who cuts hair. A barber is someone who has mastered not only the skill of cutting hair, but he's, he's mastered the business. He's mastered the whole concept of the industry as a, as a business. Uh, someone who understands how to manage time, how to manage money, how to manage people. We try to keep it real simple. If you can do those three, you have now entered into a place of being a barber. Someone who cuts hair is someone who is very talented at cutting hair. He can cut hair in his basement, he can cut hair in the attic, he can cut hair on a street corner back, back of the porch, but he hasn't taken the time out to hone his skills and make it a business. Someone who knows how to manage time, money, and people. So the biggest difference is, one, is someone who is very talented, he's on the playground, he's a playground legend, but he hasn't made it to the NBA yet. To the people who's watching this DVD, uh, I would really like to express my, my, my thoughts on, on life. And uh, one thing about life is, you know, you gotta live it, you know? And because we're living it, you know, we haven't put ourselves in no type of box of what we can and what we cannot do. Uh, either be opening up 10, 20, 30, 40, 1,000 more no greases. You know, we're not going to stop. And I would encourage people, don't stop. Live. You know, in life, there's going to be some, some, some ups, some downs, some good, some bad. But just live it. If you live life, you know, you know, It'll be worth kind of staying around for a while.